In this tutorial, we'd like to show you how to install your Joomla demos. So first, we're going to go to Downloads, Club Downloads. Make sure you're logged in. Click on Club Templates. Uh, we're going to use the, la the latest one, which is Fashion. Simply download Fashion demo. Download to your desktop. Now we're going to go to our desktop to see the folder structure first. Okay, we're going to open this demo and check out its folder structure. So, this means that if we move this zip folder as is to our web server and simply click on extract, the folder structure is, look, is going to look exactly like this. So we just want to make sure that the administration files and all installation files are not within a different folder. So simply close it. Now logging into your cPanel. And we're going to scroll down to this icon that says MySQL Databases. And we're going to create a new database. And we're going to create a new user for that database. Database name demo2. Create database. Scroll down. Right there. Add new user. Username demo2. Add your desired password. Or you can generate the password. Click on create user. Go back. Scroll down again. We're going to assign this user to database. Username demo2, assign to database demo2. Click on add. And give this user all privileges. Make changes. And remember this information, we're going to need it on an installation. Now click on home. Scroll down again. Click on this icon, it says File Manager. If you see this pop up, please make sure to show you all show a hidden file. Click on OK. And now you transfer to your public HTML. We, we have already uploaded the new fashion demo, but we're going to show you how you actually can use cPanel to do so. You click on Upload, you browse to your file. And you simply double click it. cPanel is going to automatically upload the file. Probably going to take 10 to 15 seconds. Once it's done, just click on back to home and you're going to be transferred back. You can also use uh, any FTP client like um, IP Switch or FileZilla to transfer the files to your public HTML. Now, if you are installing Joomla in a subfolder, you would need to create that folder first. So, while in File Manager, you can click on new folder, give it the name, create it, and then you're going to install the Joomla installation in this folder. Okay? So since we're installing Joomla in our public HTML, we're not going to need this folder, we're deleting it. Now the beauty about uh, CPN 11 is that it has a built-in uh, extract function, which most or let's say 99% of FTP clients do not have, so that's why we are using the cPanel to install Joomla actually. You check the uh, U Fashion demo zip or any Joomla, U Joomla demo, click on extract and click on extract files. And you are already done. All files are extracted, transferred and in order. Now you need to go to your www.yoursitename.com Type your site name in the browser and hit go. You should be presented with Joomla installer. Here you can change your language. I'm going to leave it with English. Click on next. Now we're going to do a pre check. Make sure that all files are green or settings are green. You can say yes or say off. Or off right there. Display errors. We left that on to make sure that there are no computation after the install. And if there are some bugs, you know what the error is. Click on Next. This is Joomla License. 
be more than welcome to read it. Next, this is FT, uh, this is my SQL setup. So this is exactly what we need. Okay, first here we type in localhost. Again, type it in. Do not copy and paste. If you copy and paste, Joomla 1.5 will not recognize it and is going to say that it's not able to connect to database. So type in local post. Then we need the username and the password that we created. And click on next. Okay, successfully connected. Here is the FTP layer configuration. This is to be used to install uh, Joomla extensions through FTP. We are not going to use it right now. You are more than welcome to set it up if you like to use uh, the FTP layer for uh, Joomla uh, extensions installation. So click on next. Type in your site name. Type in your email address. And type in the des desired password. And this is what makes the difference. So this is very important step here. If you do not click on this, the demo will not be installed. You are going to be presented with an empty installation. So in order to have demo look like ours, you must click on install sample data button. There you go. It says sample data installed successfully. Click on next. It says Please remember to completely remove the installation directory. We go back to our file manager and then we, then we remove our installation directory. Remove files. Go back to Joomla Web Installer and then click on site. And here is a full new fashion demo completely installed. Good in five minutes. Have fun.